Today we will read a story called The Magic of Letters by Tony Johnston and Wendell Minor. Letters hold magic. When you know their secrets, they open worlds. Each letter has a name, wonderful and strange. A, B, C. Say each name until it is your friend. Then form each letter again, again. When you place them just so, they say your name. Charlotte, Elijah, Maria, Ryan, Aaliyah, Madison, Caleb, Jack, Kaylee, Haley, Henry, Mateo, Cameron, Leah, Nathan, Sarah, Julian, Peyton, Wyatt, Letters hold power. You can shuffle them around to make loads of mighty words. Diversity, books, libraries, hearts, art, blue, trees, always. Lights, extraordinary. Limber words like acrobats. Thumpy words like clunk. Slippery words like trout. Giggly words like flipperty gibbets. Yummy words like quesadilla. Bewitching words like enchanted. Roll them in your mouth like lollipops. Clunk, acrobat, trout, quesadilla, flipperty gibbet. You will be enchanted. Now string them together until they say what you need to tell somebody. The Flibberty Gibbet ate an enchanted quesadilla and became an acrobat who slipped on a trout. Clunk! Letters hold surprises if you swinkle them sweetly. Swinkle. New words appear like swinkle. The more words you know, the more magic pours out. Carrots, love, dirt. You can write that. That cat fears the hat. Or noodles are quiet, but they Think deep thoughts. Or, I love my brother or sister a lot. Letters hold magic. When you know their secrets, like a bright bird, you take flight. You can read to discover anything you want. You can write everything that is in your head, everything that is in your heart. This book was written for the person's grandson, Noah, who on the first day of kindergarten said, we're learning the letters, but what do they do? The end.